Hello guys, Goliath Chrome 1399 here, and I'm here with Black Ops 2 Gun in Depth. So, we are covering the MTAR. This is a new series that will go on forever and ever. <laughs> yeah, I'm borrowing this mic from my dad. And yeah, so let's get started. So, the damage for the MTAR close range it does 40 damage which is a little bit over medium which is a pretty good for an assault rifle from a far distance it's 24 which is pretty cool but it, look, it lagged there a little bit so I would recommend for starters in Black Ops 2 to use this because it's a it's quite powerful and even people to this game, um, you can use it too. As you can see, my MTAR has carbon fiber and extended legs. So, the blitz kill, um, when you're close, it only takes uh, minimum three shots, and when you're far, it takes to five to six shots. Yeah. So it's mag size, um, regular no attachments to the mags is 30, uh, regular 30 bullets, yep, <laughs> and as you see mine has 40 bullets, and that means I have an extended mags, so extended mags is 40 bullets. So you won't, you'll get enough bullets to kill your enemy, you won't be running out of bullets and not killing your enemy. Sorry guys, I'm a little nervous. This is my first time doing this. Find my sock, you know. <laughs> okay, moving on. It's reload time. I think this is for the full animation. It's 2.49 seconds. Uh, the ADS is 0.25 seconds. Yeah. So you won't be having any trouble um, with slow ADS, so you're always gonna get to your get your sights on your enemy quickly. And also talking about sights, the MTAR sights are very are quite small, so you got a better view of your surroundings, which is nice. And it's very simple, which I like about this gameplay. Yeah. Now, how much, as when you're running and stuff, when you raise your MTAR up, that takes 0 0.68 seconds. Yeah. <laughs> Whew. Yeah, I'm doing this on easy vid. It'll probably be in the description. I'm not sure. Okay, so this gun is full auto, so I won't be having any trouble with that. And you must be thinking, where do I get all this information? Well, I have my iPod out right here. <laughs> and there's this app. I, I think it's just, you just have to type in Black Ops to Weapon Guide or something like that. And then you'll find it. It's only 99 cents. And I am staring at this picture right now. <laughs> okay, so... It has this bar here, and like, you know, like yeah, I don't want to say it. it's too confusing. So its fire rate is a little over 50%. Awesome. <laughs> I'm not good. But uh, it's a little, a little higher than average. So this gun overall is awesome. Why did I say that? <laughs> <clears throat> the damage is around, it's medium damage, as I said before, it's range, now, the range is exactly the same as it's crap, <laughs> uh, my iPod just turned off here, um, 
so it's basically the same. The accuracy is actually a little bit over half, so this gun overall is medium. But this vi the video, this gameplay is not done yet. Ooh, look, it says right here. Uh, the MTAR has a fire rate of 720 bullets per minute. Uh, I would say that's actually really, really good. If you're a person who likes fast shooting guns, I would recommend you choose this one. Um. <coughs> sorry. <laughs> Sorry, I'm a little silent here. There's not much to say. Uh, ooh, yeah, and then the gameplay is over. I would say if you want to put optics on it, do it. But the iron sights, well, if you want a long range optic. Uh, l long range, if you're a long range shooter, uh, put on optics. Yeah, whew. So the video is practically almost over now. <sighs> and that's practically all the time I have for today. And then uh, you can pause it here to uh, look at the clocks. And that is it for today, guys. I will see you in the next video.